Bob and Tom Tonight, starring Chick McGee, Christy Lee, Josh Arnold, and Tom Griswold. And now, here's Tom. 27 March 2020. The quarantine continues. Hang, hang on one second. I'm sorry to interrupt. Oh, what are you what are you tearing up there? They keep giving me this schedule of events. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why they're so optimistic. <laughs> uh, okay, sorry, back to you, Chick. Not Tom? worth the paper it's printed on, huh? Oh, wait a minute. <laughs> hang on, there's a second. There's a second. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Every day they Hey, Tom, how are you? I'm sure there's a third page over there, right? No, that's it. Hi, Josh. <laughs> hey, Jake, how are you, man? That was my fault. <laughs> kind, of, kind of mid-drink. There's Ace. There's, there's Pat Godwin. Hi, Chick. In Behind the, the glass. Uh, in the patio. In the confinement. In the uh, adjunct patio. Once there's again, Christy welcome to Lee. Nuremberg. I'm like Steve McQueen, I need a ball and glove can back we, here. Can we not mention Nuremberg or the Hitler haircut this morning? Well, you just did both. Okay. Yeah, I know. Well, well, he started it. Uh, well, once again, and now the show is now called, and then and then there were four. I'm as, here. As we just, I haven't finished. <laughs> I thought he said hi, Christy. No, he didn't. Uh, Remember, Tom, it's out of sight, out of mind. Uh, no, oh, no, no, I'm no, very I, well aware. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry. There's Trust a voice. me. There's a voice. In. Uh-huh. No, I, and then there were four in the in the room. In order to space, we now have. As, imagine this is a big circular table, probably twenty plus feet in. Uh, mm-hmm. In diameter, and uh, now each one of us is probably a solid ten to twelve feet away. You're insane. There is no Chick way. Chick and I are Josh three feet Chick. apart. Ace yeah. and Jack are three There's feet apart. No way. You're twenty feet from all of us. Yeah, you're safe. <laughs> ten thousand dollars says you're more than three feet apart. No, from of Chick. course we are. Um, but... Okay, I'm just trying to help. Maybe six to seven <laughs> feet, and Ace and I are six feet, maybe. Yeah. No, you're at least eight. Oh. And thank you, Chick. Uh, <laughs> I'll, I'll get a tape measure. I mean, we, we can get this done. Uh, welcome to the show. Thanks for joining us. We are indeed here. Uh, that was a special request, by the way. Some orange barrels from uh, one of the finest live performers of all time, Mr. Todd Yan. Great arrangement by Steve Ali on that one. And um, this is from Lee in Des Moines. He goes, I'm a road construction worker. We're still out on the road. Yes, you are. And uh, please watch out as usual, and they're working hard. Yeah. Please play orange barrels. So um, Give those guys a break. My God. As usual, American Forces Radio has us, and we are uh, sending it out on YouTube today. Getting a lot of new friends. It's really yeah. fun. Really fun. Good to see you all. And uh, let's just say who's who here. This is Tom speaking. Ace Cosby is our engineer. Chick I mean, McGee is across the way from the sports desk. Josh Arnold's in the sidekick chair. Hi, Tom. We have moved the Navy Federal Credit Union news desk. It now has its own room with Christy Lee occupying it solo. Yes, sir. As we continue social distancing. Pat Godwin has been uh, confined to quarters behind the glass. Hey, Pat, how's it going? Hi, this is my third microphone. How do I sound? It sounds very good, Pat. Thank, Thank you. you. Yeah, that you, sounds Josh. great. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Uh, now, uh, if, if how would it sound? Suzuki. If, that Suzuki sounds great, man. How would it sound uh, if Frank Sinatra said that? Pat? Hey, how you doing in there? <laughs> now, how would it sound if uh, you were caught and had been locked inside the trunk of a car? Hey, get out of here. Oh, that's very good. Cool. Oh, sounded like the first mic, microphone. That, that, that mic works better. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that sounds like the first <laughs> mic we had in there. Hey, we're very kind good, of scrambling. Very good. Everybody, Tom, everybody's been working real hard to yes, make sure that, uh, this, uh, that we can keep doing the show. And so that, thank you Just very for much. us idiots. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Can you imagine having to work so hard for what we spew out every day? Oh, yeah. My brother, you mentioned social distancing. Uh, my brothers uh, wanted to say hi to them. They're, they are currently, this weekend, what's now known as social fish distancing. Where they are on the lake fishing. <laughs> oh, they said show social fisting. That's what, said. what are you going to use? A oh, come ten on. foot yes, pole? Yes, uh, my brothers are yeah, engaging. You know. They're engaging in homosexual incest. You know what? Right. Yeah. That's, uh-huh. <laughs> you know, I was I was thinking too about figured, social hey. fisting when I heard. No, you were too. Who thought about that? Who? No, Nobody. they said to hell with it. Our dad died. We may as well. You know, we can do what we want now. Let's yeah. maple thorp each other and call it a day. <laughs> I'm sorry. Hey, have... by the way, here's a sports <laughs> note. Uh, earlier today, we had a couple stories in sports, and one of them was the sad passing of Curly Neal. Oh, man, Harlem Globetrotters. Yeah. I love Curly Neal. And that's when Tom 
absolutely insisted I drag out my Meadowlark Lemon story, which I know is not a good story. No, but it's interesting. You met Meadowlark Lemon me in, in Barcelona, Spain. No, and he did. I told it. And what did what was Tom's response, Josh? Oh, great story. <laughs> yeah, that's exactly right. Well, here's another story about meeting Meadowlark Lemon. Okay. okay. Hey, guys, <laughs> this is Ron. I was lucky enough to meet Meadowlark before he passed. He stood up, shook my hand. Introduced himself. My reply was, hey, you sound just like you did on Scooby-Doo. I immediately realized how stupid that sounded, but he <laughs> genuinely started laughing and talked to me about the whole Scooby-Doo experience. Oh, cool. Nice. He wouldn't shut up about it. <laughs> Extremely graceful man. And because we mentioned that, Fred Curly Neal, probably the, the most known Globetrotter, I think. He and... Uh, oh. Is yeah. Meadowlark Meadow Lemon still with us? No, uh, no, he, he's oh. passed it's away. It's singular, Meadowlark Lemon. Did you say Meadowlark Lemons? I said, is Meadowlark Lemon still with us? Oh, okay, sorry. Okay, sorry. It's kind of like when Pat tried to sing Discontent earlier. Yeah, yeah. yeah, there, yeah there was a pause there. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. You, you yeah. don't want to separate those syllables. Right? Curly passed away. He was 77. <laughs> Outside his home in Houston. He's not going to be cremated. They're going to uh, grind him into confetti and throw, oh, him, in, throw him in a bucket. <laughs> Heave it off of a ladder. All right. Okay. All right. All right. All right. So that's All what right. he wanted. Uh, hello, Bob and Tom show. Hey, Bob and Tom. It's Donnie Baker. Yep. Yeah, Donnie. it Perfect. sure is. Yeah, that's sex about that Globetrotter. It's a dark day for my best friend, Scotty Winkler. Why? He's a big he's fan. He's a huge Globetrotter. Yeah, me too. Fan. I love the Globetrotters. Hmm. Uh, but he's a flat earther, Tom, so he's torn between two worlds on him. Oh, he sure is, yeah. <laughs> yeah. What are you doing? I'm not sure if you guys heard or not, but I heard with this pandemic, since some people can't leave their house, there's a sh condom shortage. Oh. What? I didn't know. I heard some people washing out their rubbers and reusing them. Oh. Donnie. I swear to God. Oh, man. You're thinking what no. I'm thinking. Thank God every rubber's got two sides. Because could you imagine? <laughs> When yeah. I come from the school, you supposed to turn the rubber inside out and leave it in the sun for 12 hours. Really? <laughs> right. <laughs> Put it right next to the sun tea, Josh. When the sun tea's ready, so is your rubbers. Okay. But if you're smart enough like me, when you're done with it, you tie it off, stick it in your pocket that way, and wait till she's not around to get rid of it. What? <laughs> well, you gotta Tom. be careful, Tom. Women are gonna steal your seed any chance they get. Uh, okay. <laughs> Not yours. On the cusp of a receipt. Well, you say it back. My cousin Lonnie. Uh -huh. My cousin Lonnie had some chick dig his rubber out of the trash and impregnate herself because she wanted a baby that bad. Oh yeah, uh, sure. That that happens. Yeah. Well, yeah, usually with NBA pay, players. Yeah. <laughs> well, now he's got to pay child support for the next 18 years on a wastebasket, baby. Swear to God. Wash your hands every 10 minutes now. I don't see what the big deal is about washing out rubbers. Gosh. My hoodie tosses her buzzer toys in the top rack of dishwasher when she's done with it. Oh, uh, but mm. not with other dishes, I hope. Oh, she, right with the regular dinner. No. <laughs> wow. I swear to God, I found that out when I was just a kid. I was helping her empty the dishwasher. Yes. I thought her dildo was a toy rocket because it said love rocket on the side in big block letters. Yeah, sure. But I was confused by the by the vein. Oh. Anyways. <laughs> Very accurate. I knew this dude named Charles. Charles, he was always bragging about how he bought some 300 glass Lev Rocket for his wife and his best thing ever. So one night, we was all out drinking one night, and him and his wife were going on and on about this expensive toy and how good it was. <laughs> then out of nowhere, they offered to let me and Patty Ferguson borrow it. Yes. That's the sort of God. You know, like he's going to get it for the weekend. I was like, slow your roll on, man. That's disgusting. Mm -hmm. And it's unchristian. And he's like, well, you just throw it in the dishwasher, and when you're done, it's as good as new. Mm. Even Patty's like, no thanks, Pervo McGillicuddy. <laughs> I swear to God. Then he says to me, so you're telling me if someone took a dump in your Pyrex bowl, you just throw that away? <laughs> yes. 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 <laughs> like if somebody drops a deuce on my Pyrex dishes, I'm beating them over their head with the dish and then making them eat the glass. Oh, <laughs> wow. Geez. And by the way, Charles, the two of you never invited another pitch into my house ever yeah. again. <laughs> <laughs> Sit right to his face. Yeah. Uh, pour one out for Curly. I've got to go. Yeah, okay. Yeah, that's yeah, right. Thanks, um, so, the uh, the sex toys are immersible, huh? Some of yeah. them. Oh, Tom, what if, what if, wow, we couldn't do this, some, but if there was a, <laughs> we showed some Globetrotters pouring one out for Curly, and when they oh, poured it out, it was just the confetti oh, that, that came out. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> now, Mr. Godwin, we haven't had a chance to find out what's going on with you. Uh, I know that you're um, holed oh, up all by yourself. Yeah. Uh, um, with my Sinatra mic? 
And uh, you've got the microphone. You're in that little room over there. It's good to see you. Good to see you. So any observations about uh, what's happening right now in quarantine, what bit quarantine bit and bill, if you will? Well, I'm uh, all alone, so was, I just love coming here, to be honest with you. My day is a little a little rough. I would shout, I would shout, I play a little guitar. Yeah. You told me I can only go shopping once a week yesterday. <laughs> once a me. week? I swear to God he said it. You can go I, once a week. That's why I'm laughing. I have no, no doubt. No, it's absolutely true. Well, is he he's... your boss? Oh, yeah, I guess he is. <laughs> Wait a minute. So he's your boss? Of your private life. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I don't want okay. him. I, I don't want him cavorting with people out there and you know catching something and just limit your limit and your I, shopping. Make a list. Do it once a week. Get it over with. And I can't go into a, a gas station. I have to stay outside and wipe. Oh my well, hands. who's gone into a gas station lately? Really? Yeah, what are you crazy? Nobody yeah. goes into a gas station. You're nuts. So I did all my shopping last week because it was crazy out there. You know. Okay. Yeah. I have something to report here. We oh. Go. oh. <laughs> all the meat is gone. <laughs> all the meat is gone. <laughs> and the shelves are bare. And the shelves are bare. The grocery stores are ghost town. It's the Corona scare. Corona scare. Can't find any milk. Can't find any milk. Just empty space for miles. Empty space for miles. Tell me that I'm dreaming. That he's dreaming. There's nothing in the aisles. <laughs> I found Limburger cheese. Limburger cheese. And a bread that's gluten free. Gluten free. Gonna have to Google brand new recipes. Brand new recipes. What do you make with lime curd? <laughs> with what lime is curd. Pigs, knuckles, and leeks. <laughs> Can you make a stew out of turkey beaks? <laughs> Sing it, baby. Chewy. All the fish is funky. Fish is funky. And the pork is green. And the pork is green. The shelves of toilet paper have been wiped clean. They've been wiped clean. Can't find any Kotex. Can't find any Kotex. Plenty of canned lima beans. Lime lima beans. Tell me that I'm dreaming. That he's dreaming. I heard somebody sneeze. Thank you. This really is a nightmare. I think I'm starting to wheeze. I lost my singers. Somebody get me the hand sanitizer, please. Yeah. As soon as you said somebody sneeze and Josh sneezed, I had I to that, yeah. sanitize. Yeah. It creeped everybody out. Yeah. Wafted over that way. Okay, thank you very much. Very good, thank Pat. You, Pat. Thank you, Pat. Thank you. I tried to find banana yesterday. I stopped at the store on the way home. Sorry, Tom. Walked in, Once not a, a week, banana Christy. in sight. Yes, they had no bananas yesterday? No bananas. <laughs> wow. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Josh, they had no bananas. <laughs> no yesterday. bananas yeah. for me. We have no bananas. <laughs> Sad. Uh-huh. I'm freezing them. You, you are? are? Are plantains close enough? Mm. I almost bought some. Are you... Are Not you supposed to freeze bananas? Is it okay? Well, if you're out of batteries. Is that what's going on in your house? Himself. Himself? I think he's redeemed himself. Do you use the bananas in your smoothies when they're yeah, frozen? Yeah, so you, you, you take the banana, you peel them. Yeah. And they're just right. Oh, then, you peel them. Okay, then you wrap them. Then, then, you, then you wrap them in whatever plastic wrap and then you freeze them. So when you make a shake. Uh, the blender uh, has more work to do? Yeah. Well, my, my, I have a blender that uh, you could put bolts in it <laughs> and you could make a smoothie. Wow. Do you use that plunger thing a lot, though? Mine gets oh, clogged. red scarf matches your eyes. <laughs> Love it. You close <laughs> your cover before striking. Father had, had to ship the blue. What ship, the hell? Ship. <laughs> Oh, oh, there it is. I was waiting for the tie in. Yeah, bananas. I was like, where's the. Okay. Yeah, there's the, yeah, the, the plunger totally and the, the, and the, the Vitamix. Abs yeah. yeah, absolutely. Do you have one of those things? Yes. Yeah, that I used it every that, day. That blender weighs more than my first car. Yep. It's wow. pretty impressive. You've seen that, that, the Vitamix blender? It is like, it just it is making a statement. I am here. Oh, I am not moving. You've got a good blender, great. I will Super. blend anything. I have a nice healthy, <laughs> nice healthy smoothie in the morning. Chick, what's your first thing that goes in your mouth in the morning? Uh, <laughs> apologies and drugs <drunk. laughs> from the night before. The people I've robbed, called up in a drunken stupor. You know, okay, same All right. thing. All right. Same well, thing um, every morning. Got a big weekend planned. Of, uh, you going to watch anything special on Netflix? Everyone's talking about the Tiger. What is it? Tiger King. King. I already seen. Yeah, it. yeah. So I'd love to watch that. And um, I, I'm going to work something in the garage. I think uh, this weekend. Now, now I'm telling you. So, and I have witnesses. If you start watching the Tiger King and you start texting me questions, okay. I'm not answering. 
Okay. okay. All right. So don't even try. Everyone's you are going to try to watch it, aren't I you? I am, yeah. yeah. I've watched There's no way. So There's no way. Yeah, I know. I, Mark this recording. There's no way. I'm with Chick on this one. He's not going to like it. You don't he's, think so? Uh, he's going to start great. with it. And he's the gonna guy's appearance something. is going to wig him out. Yeah. And he's yep. going to go, something. no, I feel I felt dirty watching it. <laughs> I have to go watch something else. So will I be sanitizing the minute I see this? Yes, oh, absolutely. Oh, yeah, quite a bit. I, think. Yeah, I don't like animal cruelty. I don't know. You're not going to like anything about this. <laughs> <laughs> and then and one of the guys talking is missing some teeth. And a lot he, of guys. And a lot of teeth. guys. Yeah. Key locations. Arms You're not going to like that. Yeah. Yeah, bad teeth really creeps me. Oh, oh man. there are a lot yeah. of those. Well, You're going to have a rough time. Plenty to go around. Just, just, thinking, just thinking about it. I'm kind of... Just watch one episode. Okay, I will. I promise. Please, just one. All the way through. Okay. Yeah. I In all one the way city. Through. You got to okay. give it a shot. It's so Have you good. ever watched... When's the last time you watched an episode of ever, uh, anything all the way through at first glance? Uh, and you looked up and it was done. It was over. The first episode. What did I just watch? I just watched that thing, The Widow. The oh, Widow. Was that good? It was great. Cool. Is that did about your the, girlfriend uh, tell you to watch that? <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> it was very good, Pat. <laughs> you know, she hates you. You're aware of that. Oh, I did not know that, but thank you for bringing that up. <laughs> you know? Wait a minute. Hold it. Hold it. <laughs> <laughs> now we've got a show. <laughs> now that was a little too. We've got, we got a show. No, I that was genuinely funny. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You, you, wow, you just instead of out. firing back with comedy, you, you hit right. him between the eyes with a hard truth. <laughs> you went out of the building. I loved it. Yeah, no. I loved everything about it. Oh. Pat, Pat hasn't been in my house since four Thanksgivings ago. <laughs> Three. Uh, Something uh, happened. A lamp was. Uh, a lamp Lamp was lamp something was about broken. an expensive oh, lamp boy. being broken. Oh, <laughs> no, no, I'm just no, yeah, she no, hates no. you. The widow is. You know uh, that. Did you have you seen the widow? No. What's it on? You'll love it. What's it on? Because it takes place. It takes place in in, in England and in Africa. It's really. Do you good. tell? Can you tell me what it's on? What it's I have on? To look it up for myself. Yeah. I'll have to look it up. I don't know. Okay. It's really good. Cool. How, so how did I you know how to watch it? Who told you? Uh, some friends of mine. Uh, a dinner party one night. We were oh, going through things. At a to dinner watch. party. Awesome. A dinner yeah. party. You haven't been to a dinner. Oh, you've you've got to watch the wind. You simply must watch oh, the wind. I'll leave the basement while you get upstairs. Yeah. <laughs> you know. Oh. Yes. oh yes, I hate Pat Godwin. What about do you? Oh my goodness. Yeah. Uh, more salmon moose. <laughs> Oh my goodness! I think it was the incident where Pat attacked one of her friends at a charity event oh, from the okay. stage. Yeah, hey, come on! Oh boy, <laughs> that's a performance mistake. Uh, that's not a character flaw. I think it's on uh, Amazon yes, Prime. It's on Amazon Prime. Yes, <laughs> that's not a character. And, oh, and Kate, uh, Kate Beckinsale. It's great. It's really good. Oh, Alex Kingston. Yeah. Very good. Very good. That looks right, sweaty. We'll that was out. that a sweaty show? I remember seeing a trailer for it. Now that you well, met. they're in the Congo. So yeah, she, she was just what? dripping with sweat. Yeah, it's good. I'd recommend. I'd recommend. My God, the, what's your recommendation out there now? The Tiger sweat? King and what else, Chick? Uh, Tiger King's good. See, I'm knee deep in the office right now. I can't for like the third time. I can't look around. And okay, that's good. Catch anything else, Josh? Uh, something. Uh... Uh, you know what I recommend is um, if you can get if you can get a hold of it is uh, without paying a, you know, a ton of money. Ken Burns country music documentary yeah. is uh, wonderful. Just wonderful. Okay, so, very very good. Is that happening now or is that a? It's over. It, it, rewatch. But from, uh, rewatch. Where can yeah. you find it? You might be able to find it on PBS somewhere that's where i saw it but i also saw that you can buy it for like 60 bucks 60 bucks yeah so well okay who does that these days <laughs> wow. wait for my okay. next gig yeah, ken's proud of himself yeah uh, yeah okay well perhaps you could ask uh tom's girlfriend oh no she hates you um yeah don't ask her um Jeez. let's see <laughs> You know she hates you. <laughs> Note to self, don't tease Tom on the air. I have it work. It was the same tone as yesterday. I don't know. Yeah. It was the same thing. It was just so mad. You know she hates you. <laughs> <laughs> we were just a bunch of guys sitting around Jeez. after the show. You, you may have we're noticed. Just, we Pat, were so lucky. Pat, the, the invitations to my house. Yeah, they've been thin. Sort of trail. <laughs> Trailed off. <laughs> yeah, it's that no, no, that's why it's. He knows. That's why it's so hurtful. Watch the entire show live or on demand with the Bob and Tom VIP All Access Pass. Listen live with the Bob and Tom app, and make sure to visit BobandTomStore.com. 
Tune in next time for more Bob and Tom Tonight.